month away from the Free Film Festival, and one of the documentaries is getting a lot of buzz. The Now Detroit Simon Chowdhury is live at the Fillmore, where 12th and Claremont will premiere opening night of the festival. Simon, talk to us about this documentary. Well, it's about the Detroit riots from 1967, and even though it's a documentary, it's told using home videos and WXYZ news footage. This notion of two cities was very clear, and the boundary for this was the boulevard. Detroit, July of 1967. Not only is it kind of a retelling, and it's a bit of a re-education about what went down that week. Some say that event changed the city forever. The political infrastructure, the economic infrastructure of the city was rooted in this really rapid form of racism. The documentary 12th and Claremont premieres at the Freep Film Festival next month. Every time I watch it, when there's that transition from Detroit being this community to this really tumultuous event happening, I get choked up. The film is produced by the Free Press in collaboration with WXYZ and several cultural institutions. Video clips are woven together using action news footage and more than 450 home videos from Metro Detroiters. The oral histories of people that lived through it in conjunction with these home movies. So you're going to see a film that doesn't look like any other film. I said, this is not America right now. A lot of this stuff has never been seen before. Some of it's never been seen by the people that have donated to us because it's been sitting on eight millimeter reels of film that they had no ability to play until now. The retelling of the Detroit riots may leave viewers asking themselves what has changed in 50 years. This tale of two cities and it's, it's not it's not a new theme. People are going to have an, an incredibly emotional response to this film. And tickets for opening night for this film will go on sale starting tomorrow morning. The film festival is from March 30th until April 2nd, and the full lineup of events will be announced later in the beginning of March. I'll send it back to you. Mm, such a